You're not out here selling roses. Oh, yeah. Did he walk? So he's out here doing the roses. We tried just talking to him. Do you have a business license? I don't need that. So you do need a business license to sell anything or a peddler's license. Do you have an ID on you? Why? What are you doing? Because you're getting ready to go to jail is why. This is how police officers treated a 13-year-old kid who was selling palmetto roses in front of a Walmart in Somerville, South Carolina. Let's go through the footage and see whether the officers violated this kid's rights. Right off the bat, let's compare this situation to a three-year-old little girl who was selling lemonade in Kansas City a couple of years ago. Do you want to see a police officer today? Are you going to hug him? Yeah. What do you want to be when you get up, grow up? Police officer. Yeah. Another one. <laughs> Is that exciting? She's been out here since seven, so that energy is coming from somewhere. Oh my gosh, the sheriff! Oh, the sheriff's here! Oh, ah! Dude, we got the whole street! Oh my gosh. <laughs> you got it, honey? Here. Look at her. She's a loud night, guys. Introduce yourself, Hannah, and shake your hand. Hi! I'm Kate. Nice to meet you. Say, I'm Hannah. The way the officers treated the three year old girl was great. But you say the three-year-old girl was nice to the officer. She wants to be a police officer when she grows up. Yes, but would she want to be a police officer if the officers came up to her aggressively and accusatory and in, in a demeaning way, in a threatening way? Would she still have reacted the same or would, would she have cried and run to her mother, her grandmother, and never ever want to see a police officer again? These sorts of things don't happen in a vacuum. So let's compare the situation with the three-year-old girl in Kansas City with what happened in South Carolina. On April 1st, officers with the department's hospitality team, LOL, were patrolling North Main after receiving complaints about people loitering and selling palmetto roses. Two officers, Gee and Sergeant Catherine Kirkland, used the public announcement system in their marked patrol vehicle to tell the two young men selling palmetto roses in front of Walmart to move along. When they refused, now this is according to the, the cop's statement, the officers exited the vehicle to speak with them. Because the two sellers were blocking the entrance and exit of Walmart, officers asked them to step aside. Well, you can see for yourself. 